I cannot wait to replace you with AI. What do you think a James AI story would sound like? Here's some trash. It's a gift. Duct tape in my trunk. I'm not a creep. I'm just a predator. You're one ugly motherfucker. I love AI James. You look like a predator hunter right now. Hell yeah. You know I'm what? country camo now. And this uh, is a pitch a pitch for Netflix. Yes. Julie Michaels says that Jess Tromboni is already <laughs> going with Ted Duncan. I can't read this anymore. Come on, let's go. Oh, that's the that's line. That's a line. <laughs> I'm just really good at acting. Why do you hate Applebee's? Uh, they're lame. They have bad food. Okay, perfect. I mean, the only thing good Fair about enough. there is the, like, free watered-down beer. Well, don't they also have, like, dollar drinks? They don't drinks? have free watered-down beer. Yeah, if you, talk, if you talk to the bartenders uh, nice enough, yeah. What? That's not, that's what? not what? a good deal that... What are you what? talking about? This is your brain. This is drugs. This is your brain on drugs. And oh, we're, we're back. back. Oh, we're back, Jigs! baby. Yeah. Twins. Yeah, Twins. Spe speaking of Jigs, you Spe jinxed me on the shirt here, yeah. buddy. And the hat. You literally wore the camo version of my outfit. So I, I did. Look at I, the pants, too. I basically. The whole thing. I improved upon what you were doing. I invented all that stuff. And that's stolen valor, James. I love the idea of inventing shirts. I do invent <laughs> shirts for a living, okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look, you see how genius that shirt is? It mm -hmm. makes no sense. Clearly, you know, we is, uh, we didn't talk about what to wear before this episode. So. Clearly. Clearly. Whatever. Imagine us being like, all right. Well, actually, I will say there is some times where I'm just like, <laughs> I want to text him like, what are you guys wearing yeah, today? What are you wearing <laughs> like, today? Just curious. I mean, I now that going? we're on video, might not be a bad idea. Yeah, it, it, it didn't matter, matter, right? matter before not because it all. was just audio. It uh, matters yeah. to me. Yeah. It does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, okay. Everyone can see the look of disgust on my face when you talk to. Yeah. It's perfect. I love this. What are you Dude. wearing? Nothing yet. This, so I, mean, I, I rarely talk about Meth Syndicate on the podcast, but this shirt right here, um, every time I wait in line at Universal Studios, there's a Deer Hunter poster, and it's just this image of Robert De Niro with a gun to his head. And I'm just like, it's so hard. It's such hard imagery. Like, mm -hmm. how would I. Oh, for the studio tour. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, I'm yeah like, how would I make that a shirt? I want to use that someday. Uh, and. I could not think of anything. So then I was just looking at a weird like logo play and the fact that it was red and white with this logo made it look cool. Yeah. But because I did it as a mystery shirt and everyone's like, I don't get it. What's the joke? What's the joke? And there is no joke, but I charged twelve ninety nine for the shirt. Oh. Okay. And it's the all you can eat. Uh, boneless wings, twelve ninety nine shirt. And so if you don't know like, now, you know, you can go to Applebee's. Also, Which it was twelve ninety nine for a T-shirt. Cut me some slack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> there you go. Also, twelve ninety nine for all you can eat buffalo boneless wings. I would or... <laughs> I would consider that Russian. Talking to the buffet yeah. man over here. Are you kidding me? This is the deals guy. He's no. always looking for some kind of food deal. Twelve ninety nine. You buy or... discounted meat. Oh God, don't do that with your teeth. Oh, oh God. Oh. Um. Oh, yeah. Horrible. Fucking uh. Uh, Twelve ninety nine. All you can eat, huh? I, I think I'm a little. <laughs> All I think, you can eat bone. I think I'm outdated though, because I was watching football this past Sunday, and it was like, yeah. like fucking Rolling Stones part started playing. It was like, stop me up. And it was like, oh, you can eat buffalo yeah, yeah, yeah. wings. Fourteen ninety nine. And I was inflation. like, inflation, inflation, inflation. Still not bad though, right? That's still not a bad deal. Are they good though? I well, feel here's like, the thing: oh. you don't have to cut a uh, a chicken's arms off to to. You could be any part of really like. Boneless could be any meat from a chicken, it's right? It's not just breast? I don't think so. I don't think they're giving up all you can eat wings in general. Right? <laughs> all For... you can eat chicken breast? <laughs> yeah. No, what's a, what's a yeah, chicken yeah, yeah. tender? It's a breast, right? I mean, I guess a, like a, a piece of a breast. But like some of this shit is mechanically separated and smashed back together for uh, mm. public consumption, but I don't think Applebee's does that. McDonald's definitely does. But yeah, yeah, I don't know the logistics. Applebee's slander on this episode, jeez. Oh yeah. Also, I'd like to say fuck Apple. I hate, <laughs> I fucking hate Applebee's. Do you dude. really? Yeah, I hate them. I uh, like why. Because, I mean, first Make of all... Make it quick, but why? Ch Ch Chili's gang. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I feel like now, from now on, I'm always going to have that. Are just you... like anything I say, like now. Like, but get hurry it, it so up. So why do you hate Applebee's? So you are Chili's gang. I'm Chili's, Chili's gang. Chili's gang. Yeah, I'm Chili's gang. Chili's, oh, I hate Chili's. Chili's core, big time. But yeah. ever since they removed the original chicken crispers, R.I.P., uh, I think I'm more of a... Um, oh, fuck. What? I had it the other day, but don't worry. I'll, There's like five chain restaurants. Yeah, but I, I gotta. I, I'm not one to uh, like delegate these things lightly. Uh, if I'm gonna pick my favorite chain restaurant, well, we can it's go down the be... line and do that. But I need to know. Get back to the original point. Why do you hate Applebee's? 
Uh, they're lame. They have bad food. Okay, perfect. I mean, the only thing good Fair about enough. there is the like free watered down beer. Well, don't they also have like dollar <laughs> they don't drinks? have free watered down beer? Yeah, if you what? talk, if you talk to the bartenders, uh, nice enough. Yeah, what? that's not a, that's what? not what a deal. The that fuck they are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Give me some free beer, bitch. Water it down, please. Damn, you know, I'm country camo now. You know a guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The good thing, the only good thing about Applebee's was their stupid cheap drinks. Yeah, like, didn't they have like dollar Long Islands or Exactly something? right, but at 38 years old, that's heartburn in a fucking yeah. ruined yeah, night no, after I one. So but back also, in the day, though... At the same time, too, that's that's every chain restaurant, is is the drinks, is the cheap drinks. Yeah. Um, I mean, also, I love the little Chili's mugs. They're tiny, but they're, like, thick, so they make you feel like a big boy. Like yeah, hearty. that's yeah. literally yeah. how you trick people into thinking they're getting, they're getting more of a deal. Yeah, yeah exactly. that's why I used to buy... And it just works for you? I used to buy exclusively like the little mini Coronas just, yeah. to, just to feel like a big boy. Oh, that's not what we're talking about. And that's weird, but I, that's okay. Corona Ritas. Yeah. Make just your hands James look big. The, James and the Giant <laughs> Corona yeah. Rita. James and the Giant Beer. <laughs> oh my God. Um, yeah. Chili's gang, Chili's gang. On the gang. other side of that, there's a uh, cool bikini bar, not a strip club, but Jumbo's Clown Room. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Serves their beers in, in draft mugs, but they're super light plastic. And on the contrary, I drink them like in a sip because it, it, the weight is lighter, so it, I'm just like. I love that too. Like that's why that's I like smart too. Seventies, my money. 70s beers always look so uh, delectable. I'll use that word. What do you mean? <laughs> because though? They're, beer they're looks always, the same. They're always tiny. They're always tiny. Like from bars, they're always any seventies like beer glass or yeah. check any say Deer Hunter, uh, Cheers, any seventies television or movie. Yeah. At a bar, they're always served in like tiny glasses or tiny mugs. It's probably oh, really? like maybe the same like twelve ounces. We're gonna have to like... James fact check this because that's I don't I mean, know. The only way I believe this Seven... is is that sixteen ounces is a standard pint now. Yeah. And a can is twelve. Yeah. So maybe back in the day they just, they just had everything. 12 12, ounce, yeah. Maybe. But I'm also like, obviously, he likes the small, cute ones. Oh, God. I love, I love a little <laughs> kick, kick, cute. Just one I'm episode cute. if we could make it through and not bring to the spotlight no, that James I'm is talking a creep. more about like <laughs> uh, kawaii stuff. Oh, yeah. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I love yeah. a nice kawaii beer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Nice, dude. Sapporo. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. A nice kawaii asahi. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Perfect, dude. Yeah. And that's, I'll, that's all I'll say about it. <laughs> I'm fucking well, real. Dude. Uh, kawaii beers. Okay. I can't. I cannot wait to replace you with AI. Uh, <laughs> we've actually been working on it with the technology. We're just not there yet. Yeah. One day, one day we'll be able to replace. What's, you. What do you think a James AI story would sound like? <laughs> oh, dude! Okay, I... Start with that for sure. <laughs> like, um, like, <laughs> like, yeah, like, um. So yesterday, bad prices and all. Next time, I was like, found a free beer. <laughs> Super sick. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah, dude. Here's some trash. It's a gift. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take, take this trash gift. Duct tape in my trunk. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not a creep. I'm just a predator. Ugly motherfucker. <laughs> I love AI James. You look like a predator hunter right now. Hell yeah. Uh, deer hunter. I'm digging it though. I'm, I like it. I got it. the deer hunter outfit, baby. Yeah, yeah. it's it's very um flashy. Mm-hmm. Is it? I don't know. I think that's supposed to be the opposite of camo, but it's, it's really standing out. Hell yeah. I mean, I'm I love a man in uniform. Talkers. I love to stand out by blending in, baby. Yeah. Mm. Amen. Mm. Amen. yippee Kaye. Yeah. Just, just James behind a palm tree. <laughs> fucking Burbank. <laughs> Have you? Do you ever go to all those chain restaurants in Burbank, like the ones by that airport strip mall? That no, has, I, I, I like. They have like every chain restaurant ever in that area. I, I, I love them and I love going by them and like fantasizing about them. But like, one day, I, yeah, I, one I, day you'll go. I, I rarely like eat shit. Yeah, I'm. I'm just well, like. Well, I, wait, I, back, back that up. No, you rarely like, eat shit. When yeah, do you yeah. see James eat? I just, I just take. Oh, that's them. true. You, I guess you just don't eat in general. Yeah, yeah I mean, just, I, I also, I don't like. I have a pretty. Like okay diet, yeah. it's it's more so portion control. I'll eat yeah. salad, but I'll eat a dang lot of it. Yeah, sure, okay. sure, sure. Fair enough. Yeah, like in a perfect world, like TGI Fridays would be a low calorie thing, and you can oh, just go eat that not. all the time. Yeah, we're just into the it's age. Trash. Yeah, but it's more like the gimmick that we're all obviously into, like being able to go to like this stupid chain bar or restaurant, and you know the service is going to be kind of crappy, the food's going to be crappy, the drinks are going to be crappy, but there's just like an aesthetic there that's. I don't know, like the 90s. I feel like yeah. those are kind of all dying out. Mm-hmm. Like, didn't one of those chains just go bankrupt? Uh, TGI Fridays is going under. Yeah. Thank God. Uh, Which, like, those were everywhere growing up. Rest in, well, rest that, in was, that was my number one. Absolutely. Really? And then, and then we went to a show Over in Chili's. years ago. Over Chili's. I, 
like 90s TGA Fridays. Yeah. So sick. Even early 2000s, they introduced the Jack Daniels sauce on everything. So yummy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So uh, yummy. Dude, like, dude I, I'm excited just thinking re- about it, dude. Jack Daniels yeah. sauce. Yeah. So, no, so yummy, Tommy. Now I have like high blood pressure and mm-hmm. I fantasize about well, eating food like that. But. I, uh, maybe we'll release it, maybe we won't, but in like the forbidden episode that we recorded that I didn't uh, upload yet. We talked about yeah. my the tough mother. Yeah, the one that we just recently like uh, did a couple. Uh, oh, times that ago. one. Oh, yeah. yeah. Um, we talked about my tough mother. We won't talk about it again. You can bring it up. No. Well. Oh, earthquake. Um, <laughs> you guys my that? upstairs neighbor jumping up and down yeah. a bunch. Um, she has a, yeah, a the, loom factory. We went. <laughs> we went directly, so it was like a like a three hour drive away. We drove three hours back right after the Tough Mudder. And Are we- you talking about Las Vegas again? Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. Why are you letting them do this? Uh, no, it- I'm tired. Did you win? Did you win? Did you lose? <laughs> Uh, Tough Mudder, I, I actually, yeah, I won. I did okay, really good. Okay, James won, won Tough I, I did surprisingly good at Tough Mudder, but uh, my, the whole point is we uh, we came back and went like three hours back home and went it, directly to Chili's. Oh. Yeah, yeah. What'd you get? Uh, a shitload of beer. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's Watered how you- Watered down that's, free a sh- beer? A shitload of beer, uh, margaritas, and- um, I, I think we just got a bunch of like samplers and just fucking- Okay, like free. Southwestern rolls, Because like I said- no more original chicken crispers. R.I.P. What happened? What do you think happened? Uh, they were probably giving away too many free heart attacks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, great. Yeah. I don't think companies like that give a fuck. Yeah, well, I don't think they care. It was probably some kind of product loss because I'm it was sure, too much I mean, quality of meat. McDonald's changed their shit. Like, I think I think at a certain point, everybody's mm. hopping on the train of like, uh, well, now we have we don't have to be healthy, but we have to at least give off the illusion like we're pretending to be healthy. Mm. Sure. You know, hey, we changed our chicken McNuggets. Sure, but they're still like. Yeah. Chicken McNuggets. I, there, there must be laws against this, but like my mind always thinks like I love the idea of advertisement for better or worse. Like I always, my brain always thinks about certain like funny things or, yeah. or, or angles. And obviously there has to be some sort of regulation so it's not false advertising or like misleading. But like I would love. Like, I don't think so. I think that's I don't the know, opposite but, of this country. No, like picture like a, like a lady next to a lake. In okay, like, hold jo- on a second. <laughs> All right, I'm picturing. I'm, I'm Imagine pinching a okay, loaf. Close, close good. your eyes. You're, Let's picture okay, this. Good. Mm-hmm. No, but just I'm a lady. Close my eyes around you. Close, a lady close walking close down. <laughs> my God, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> a lady like running past a lake in like leggings. Yeah. And like a short little, whatever fucking workout top. Yeah. Oh yeah. And then it's just like, this thir- like Thursdays only at Applebee's, mm. and it just like describes a whole ass healthy meal. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But to like a Ozempic commercial, like like <laughs> yeah. one of those like pill commercials. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah but it's just an Applebee's commercial. Yeah. Huh. You trick people into fucking. Oh, anything. I probably yeah, yeah. I think they do probably do that with like it's their like... their like steamed vegetables or well, like I'm sure they probably do advertise things like that, but that's not what people are going there for. But then I want a guy in fast talking to describe all the side effects yeah yeah yeah. oh yeah yeah. 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 okay may cause extremely manliness (laughs) yeah 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 yeah, yeah. women may be extremely attracted to you see that's that's too bud lightish it would have to get really it would have to be weird Mm -hmm. one in three people get mumps well i i also like the idea i'm sure a lot of like advertisements do it where it's like gives you mumps yeah our chicken gives you mumps (laughs) yeah yeah yeah. i said keep it real yeah (laughs) welcome to tgi fridays it's mumps mumps wednesday uh what is mumps uh mumps is uh after the chicken no that's shingles uh, mumps is like when you like. Pr- you get bumps all over your body. That's yeah. bumps. No, no, it's mumps. It's it mom- rhymes. Mumps is extreme. <laughs> Does it mean me- mumps, bumps, and humps? Oh, Does it mean same thing? Many, got- many bumps. Many bumps. <laughs> many bumps. More bumps than you'd like. Mm-hmm. Mumps, uh, monster bumps. I don't know. It, it's you get lumps on your body. From mumps. Yeah. Mumps is bumps. I'm but pretty it, sure it, it comes. <laughs> I don't from know. Something. I've never had. Knock on wood. I've never I, had the mumps. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's a reason why these vaccines exist or have existed for a while. Not to get too political about the mumps. You don't vaccine. look. You don't look like you like yeah, vaccines you in that look- outfit, buddy. <laughs> hey, the chicken <laughs> box vaccine is making the freaking frogs. Bring back gay. the Chili's chicken box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Chili's is making the frogs gay. <laughs> um. Yeah, no, uh, mumps is, uh, I feel like it comes from something else, though, like shingles comes from chicken pox, right? Yeah, it's like old, it's like if you didn't get chicken pox as a kid, or you, mm. yeah. But you got it as yeah. like an adult. It's no, old guy chicken No, but you could just get bugs. shingles as a child. A lot of children died of shingles back in the day. That's well, sad. yeah, because they didn't get it that. Sad. Thanks yeah. for bringing that up. I, lo- I love to talk <laughs> about dead kids. Um, yeah. Yeah. No. One minute you're talking TGI Fridays, <laughs> dead kids. Oh, yeah. Can't always be Friday. Can't always be a good time. 
Yeah. Right on. <laughs> oh. I don't know. We can all talk. There's a whole list of diseases I know nothing about, apparently. So Right on. Cho- Google in. Chime in now. Call in now. And please tell us what the difference between mumps uh, and shingles are. 911. Oh, jeez. Uh, so how about Gypsy Rose? Everybody's talking about Gypsy Rose, right? What is that? Uh, Gypsy Rose. Uh, uh, person? So- yeah, she's a person. It's a girl. Uh, she's the woman that we saw the documentary. Her mom like tricked her into thinking oh. she was sick, and then her and her boyfriend killed her mom. Oh yeah. Um, and then she went to jail, but at the same time, she was like tortured and and manipulated, and just like this whole her whole existence was a lie, and her mom was uh, abusing her. Yeah. And so that's why she killed her, and she's out of jail now, and it's kind of like a liberating. Well, you know, did good you for actually, her. Did you hear she started an OnlyFans? No, she yeah, didn't. Her handle is Tipsy Toes. Really? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Gypsy Rose, Tipsy Toes. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> uh, like one she... more time. Uh, yeah. Gypsy Rose. Is this <laughs> true? Is this <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Yeah, fact? she shows off her feet uh, to OnlyFans. And, uh, this her, is, I mean, her it, it, is this tip, isn't true. Toes. It's a genius idea. Yeah. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Okay. Cool. Well, good for her. I mean, hey, you know. No, 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 hey, no. Gypsy? We're just going to show your feet. Collect oh. all the money. Just Yeah, just sell them as Gypsy Rose, Tipsy Toes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. No one's going to know. No one will know. My feet look exactly like Gypsy Rose's oh feet. It's, she's like very small, right? Yeah. yeah. I, got, I got tiny little, I got it's little like, tootsies, It's dude. just like the worst Photoshop. It's just like a big thick leg like with tattoos. James, and then it, like, James is like yeah. flask and vapor on the ground oh still. Oh my God. Picture. Hell yeah. Well, she doing okay? She killing yeah. it? I think she's, she's out. It's, it's actually kind of cute watching. Uh, she's, actually, she's like going to Times Square for the first time. And she's like, this was always a dream of mine. And like just little. Think she went to Chili's? Maybe. I bet I would have. You think she's a Chili's girl or Friday's girl? Gypsy Rose, crispy, crispy <laughs> critters. Cris, cris, crispy critter toes. Yeah, yeah. great. Um, yeah, I think she's doing a little too well, though. It's suspicious. I'm yeah. suspicious of her. Well, that's being a hater. Yeah. Yeah. You I'm know. a suspicious hater on. Yeah, I don't like this girl who got tortured her whole life and went to jail. <laughs> yeah. uh, is getting too much attention. I'm standing up for herself. I don't know. She, I think she's st- she, she should still be in jail. Oh, that's a hot take. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Yeah. That's the lock deal. her up. <laughs> lock her up. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh my goodness. Well, that's beautiful. Thanks, AI James. <laughs> yep. That's not AI James. That's why we're getting AI James. Yep. Yeah, we need an TGI AI James. TGI J. TGI James. Thank God it's. Not James T. <laughs> oh my God. I'm on the sauce, baby. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, well. So I wanted to bring up some, like like I said earlier, uh, we can we can go over things already, but I want to pick your yeah. brains about like just very basic fun stuff or whatever, music and movies and all that. Like, okay. Do you remember your first like favorite movie as a child? Oh, geez. Uh, I, I used to have, so... Back in our day, right, mm. we had VHSs and stuff. Yeah, I've right? heard of them. Oh, <laughs> fuck. I'm showing my age. Yeah. <laughs> uh, James, you're showing your penis again. No, not um, again. AI James. So, a- yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> AI James doesn't have a penis. <laughs> yeah. He's much safer. <laughs> P- AI James. Um, so, uh, so VHS will... Uh, yeah. Uh, let me make this story as long as possible. I love it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. We're gonna speed, speed it up, up in the editing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, editing. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, no, so there's only like a limited amount of uh, movies in my ar- artisanal. What is that? Not a arsenal. T- arsenal. You you look like you would know the word arsenal right now. Oh my god. Um. So. Uh, Deer Hunter was one of them, but I was never. Are you alive. serious? I swear to God, yeah. Have you I, seen it? Uh, I didn't see it as a kid. I saw no. it when I was a little uh, older. But we're we talking had about your favorite movie as a kid. Yeah, so no, I had Jack. Of... I had Jack with oh, nice. uh, Robin Williams. Oh, I, yeah. I watched that uh, like so many fucking times, and I remember. This that explains a lot. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because I'm like a, he's a like big an baby. Adult. I'm, yeah, reverse, yeah, 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 I'm yeah. reverse aging, yeah. Yeah, mm. for sure. So Jack. Yeah, yeah. So Jack. So that yeah. So I wouldn't say it was my favorite movie. I my favorite movie was mm, Small Soldiers. Really? Yeah. You had some rare ones, dude. Yeah. Yeah. What about you? Uh, how? What age are we talking? Baby, baby, child. I guess first like solid yeah, core like memory two, of like two years old. What was your favorite movie? I mean, like <laughs> I loved Homeward Bound, even though it was sad. Brave Little Toaster. Brave Little Toaster, definitely mm-hmm. up there. The Spice World movie. Yeah, that mm-hmm. was a huge movie for me. I was like nine or ten. Didn't a guy call you a whore one time for liking the Spice <laughs> Girls? <laughs> yes. She, that's she, so thank what? you for that memory. That, she, sorry, yeah. but that's like the most asinine yeah, way so to insult someone. I was playing the Spice Girls at work one time. I'm yeah. a bartender. I was playing the Spice. Girls and uh, he was like, I can't believe you want to listen to this whorish band. What and I said, fuck? This is the Spice Girls. And he goes, Yeah, they dress like a bunch of whores and they act like a bunch of whores, so they are a bunch of whores. 
and you're there's a whore. Just a, there's just a guy getting just a guy getting drunk, and he goes, and you are a whore for liking them. Jesus. And I um oh. I kicked him out. Damn. Good, yeah. I, I fucking kicked him off. Fuck that shit. Yeah, oh, wait, no, you're, first talk, off, you're talking about recently. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were talking about when you were a kid. No, yeah, because I, sla- I was slanging drinks, you yeah, know, yeah, when like I was a child. Yeah. Yeah. You like that little you yeah, dumb see, only whore? James like, I guess think, so. Only James would think about calling a child a whore. Yeah, well, yeah. I do it all the time. Yeah, you know. You well, know? sometimes, yeah. Sometimes you just got to <laughs> put those kids in their place. We'll put them down. <laughs> yeah, no, it was really fucked up. That is weird. I mean, people have bad opinions, and that's one of them. So. It's no, it's that's not a that's a that's a psychotic opinion. <laughs> it's insane. No, that's like crazy. Like women hating. Like there's something wrong with that man. Yeah. You know, well, like he, may, maybe he tried to hit on one of them once, and they told him to kick rocks, or he's got like this fucking association with women in, in dresses. I don't know yeah. what's going on with men's brains, but that's exactly where his mind went, and oh, it was weird. It was weird. Women How old in dresses was, that, was like old like. Oh yeah, like probably like uh 50s, 60s. All right, makes a little older, more sense. Older, but... yeah. Yeah, but it's dude. still crazy because it's like it's the fucking Spice Girls. It's a whole look. It's a whole iconic part of you know. Like, do you have a problem with every woman pop star? Is it yeah. specifically the Spice Girls? Yeah, uh, the sexiest thing that guy can deal with is like, happy birthday. Yeah, exactly. Ooh, Mr. <laughs> yeah, boner, boner, yeah, yeah, boner. Like, oh, did you see her ding, knee? Ding. Yeah. It, was very, oh. it was very incel behavior. Yeah, that's all. Mm-hmm. It was very like OG. Have you, yeah. yeah, OG I incels. Know. OG incels. Um, I used to so I I used to also be obsessed with Spice Girls uh, when I was a kid. For real? Uh, yeah, yeah. I I love Spice Girls and I love the Spice World movie, of course. Yeah. I remember one time I found at Stop and Shop and just like remember Stop and Shop used to sell or like grocery stores used to sell CDs. Yeah, and, and DVDs uh, and BH like they always I had saw, stuff like that. I saw I saw a Spice Girls one. And it was like, and like bins. it was like four dollars, uh, or it was like super cheap. And I was like so excited. I was like, "Fuck yeah! I'm gonna spend all my allowance money on this." I got home, and it was literally just a Spice Girls interview, and <laughs> I was so fucking pissed. <laughs> I was like, I thought it was some like secret album that yeah. I'd never heard before, and I was like, "Fuck yeah!" And it was just like, "Yeah, so like on the first album, like we really like." Pulled the like uvulas out or whatever. <laughs> oh, I it's like, did you have a discman or did you take it home and put your dis- room? I had discman, so, like, but I, I th- probably brought it home. <laughs> Dude, that's so funny. I remember it was like, yeah, it was like unauthorized Nirvana, and I'm mm. like, oh my god, this must have like bootleg songs since before the internet, right? Mm-hmm. Like or our internet. But yeah, then listening and be like. It's a fucking interview. You just bamboozled a child into yep. buying those discs, dude. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. Like ridiculous, dude. Oh, man. Capitalism, baby. Yep. Oh, it's, so I it mean, didn't say it wasn't like music. It would. It was just saying no, it was it, kind of... Probably in the back, it just said all this nonsense We're as a kid. We're also kids. You're kids. Yeah, You're yeah. just like, Four what bucks. is this secret? Reading. I wasn't, yeah. I wasn't one of those nerds. I am nowadays, but I wasn't. Back I in wish the day. that that was the only like Spice Girls album you bought. So like you're like I love them, but you've never actually heard them. You yeah. just heard that one you're album. Saying... Oh yeah, and I'm sure you know. Uh, in the spirit of retelling stories that I'm sure we've told on the podcast before. <clears throat> sure. Um, uh, back when I was a kid, the only thing I wanted for Christmas one year was the new Madonna album. Mm-hmm. Which one? Um, I forget. It was. Uh, I think it was with. Sing, sing, sing. Or, oh, okay, that makes sense age wise. So was, you were like, yeah, okay. I was, yeah, I was yeah, a little yeah. too old to be listening to Madonna. No, no, no. I was like, I was like, Madonna's I was like thirteen, timeless. fourteen yeah. when that came well, out, dude. E- no, e- you were a child. Either way, I was so excited for it, and I told my mom, "It's like it's all I want. All I want is." I was aggressive about it, you know, like, yeah, like all I want is Choking the new, your mom. yeah, Madonna yep. album, whatever. Yeah, okay. Um, but she was like, uh, like you can get other stuff. Like that's just like a, a CD. Like what else do you want? I was like, nothing. All I want, just all I want is this. And uh, I got it in my uh, stocking. Oh. You did? Mm-hmm. I thought I thought it was going to be was like a, be a, jing- horror- yeah, a jingle a all the way. No, the no, no. It was the best Christmas ever. Oh, oh my God. Happy right, ending. Right up there when I woke up with my dad smoking butts, drinking beers at 6 a.m. Hell yeah. yeah and he was Say like, it, I'm leaving. Open your presents. <laughs> yeah. oh, uh, that my, one was up I'm there. sure we'll have him on eventually, but my buddy Colin, who does Large Humongous, oh. has a funny story about getting promised an electric guitar. I'll, I'll have him tell it better one day, but he got promised an electric guitar for Christmas, like all, for months and months and months. And then his mom <laughs> gave him a card and she like cut out a picture of it in the magazine and like put it in the card. And she's like, it's not here yet, but it's coming. Sorry, blah, blah, blah. And then he's like, and it never came. Oh my so for God. Christmas, he got a picture of an electric guitar. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah! Absolutely brutal. Oh, Love you, Colin. Terrible. I'm sorry for yeah, I'm yeah. sorry for your trauma, brother. <laughs> that's so sad. But it's all, yeah. very, I mean, it is horribly sad. But now he has this like way funny yeah. story forever that mm-hmm. I told for him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Stolen valor. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stolen valor. Yeah, 
yeah. You suck. You suck. Yeah, funniest thing you said all day was someone else's story. You piece <laughs> yeah. of shit. Hell yeah. Fuck yeah. Well, that's what we're here for. Right on. Amen. How's the uh, how's everything else? <laughs> Fucking great. So good. So good. Dude. So good, dude. Hell what yeah. about your favorite? I mean, I think I can already guess what your favorite mm. movie or. On the count of three. One, two, three. Ghostbusters. Oh, oh, oh there wait. you go. I was just going to let you do it. <laughs> you, you, was that what you were thinking? Could have been a great moment. No, Ghostbusters would have been my first you, you guess. You went a little maybe. too fast. But, but same thing. It was very fast. It was kind of fast. I was stunned. And I was trying to think of a joke, but you, you know. No, no. It was so quick. He didn't, maybe it wasn't ne- even seconds. It was, it was one, two, three. Yeah, that maybe was next unfair. time one, two. two. Ghostbusters. Color purple. I still oh. can't uh, think of anything. Uh, <laughs> Legends of the Fall. Uh, I Couple. Still... Watership Bridge, Down. Bridge to Terabithia. Page, yeah. page oh. Master. That was another one. I still haven't seen that. I Oh. I know. I got to no see that. No spoilers, but the books talk. Uh, the, uh, boy, uh, the boy in striped pajamas. <laughs> oh, that movie's so sad. <laughs> uh, Schindler's List. Uh, um, dude, so same thing in my artisanal back mm. home mm. Uh, oh. <laughs> yeah. mm. Ghostbusters for sure yeah. but also Die Hard 2 as a kid? yeah and like sure yeah my, so I had it at my father's house and my stepmom's house for some reason when like Tipper Gore came out in the 90s and waged war on the, on the parental advisory like sure. censoring CDs like had all these families and parents in like a panic like going through and reading the lyrics because they're like these people are saying awful shit they're not even oh yeah they're not even understanding context like um a bad example is, but like Dead Kennedys has a song called "Kill the Poor," yeah, and it's just like all sarcasm, yeah, but like in support a, of the poor and taking down the the 1%. exactly, and yeah. like you know they write ang- they write songs from angles of the the bad guy. Did and people like, really think that meant like go kill poor people? Yeah, because like you hear a song yelling yeah. "Kill the poor" and you're not you're people don't fucking understand art in that sense sometimes. But like adults, you can't just like. Have you been on the internet, dude? Mm-hmm. Yesterday, someone posted that the Eiffel Tower was on fire, and like. Six million people thought the Eiffel Tower, a metal object, was in blazes, dude. Because can someone metal posted, not light on fire? It can, no, it light on fire, no, it definitely. Right? No, if you saw the photo, dude, it was like blazed out. Like yeah, it was yeah, an, yeah, yeah, It was an like AI, AI picture. Like the flames yeah. were way too big. And everyone's like, "Here it is, World War Three. Here we go." And I'm like, "You're dumb. You're so dumb. Yeah. These are but adults." At the same time, like, good, good on people for at, at least trying to incite World War Three. I say let's rip the Band-Aid off. <sighs> it's just... already happening. Oh yeah. My God. Let's just do it. It's the fucking worst time in the world to stop, start a podcast. I know. Listen to yeah. me talk while everyone around us is dying. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like, what was right. your favorite? Wow, yeah. Boy in the Strange yeah. Pajamas, and I, Ghostbusters. Oh. I'm not going to mention anything specifically, of course. We don't want to go down that road. But uh, uh-huh. I love with all the things actually going on now, mm. people being like, you know what? Let's let's like uh, let's get a little ruckus by like faking something. It's like oh no, yeah, you, yeah. You, like you could just do that. You could just mention something that's literally going on right now. Yeah. Oh my god. Dude. Well, no. Everybody wants a distraction. Nobody wants to talk about mm-hmm. what's my, actually happening. Like the Wendy's burger changed. Excuse no. me. No flip. <laughs> Is yeah. it not square <laughs> it, anymore? It, it's it's di it's a uh, uh, diamond now. You, they just. That's just a square <laughs> turn. <laughs> yeah, they just turned it. Yeah. Tell tell that to Wendy. <laughs> I will. Uh, what's that helicopter. Oh, let's take a helicopter break. Yeah, they're on. They're on us now because we mentioned the Wendy's burger change. See what you're doing. You're inciting World War Three in our home. I stand with Wendy. Oh my god. Um, and we're and back. I'm with her. Do you? You? So I. I don't eat. You know, red meat or whatever. But my favorite sandwich of all time was the Big Mac. I think that was like the ill sandwich. I don't care if it's garbage or whatever, but it is now. They just came out with a double Big Mac, or it's coming out this week. You mm. might have to try it and let me know. You got to yeah. let me know. Well, we've had the vegan Big Mac from uh, McCharlie's or whatever that place is. Yeah, that place is. rules. That's so good. Not an endorsement. So good. Does rule though. No, we're sponsored by Hanes Beefy. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah. yes. Hanes Beefy. Hanes Beefy. Tees. Speaking of beef, <laughs> let's all yeah. let's take a quick Hanes Beefy break. Oh, yeah. uh, <clears throat> sit here and think about it. What is Hanes Beefy? Hey guys, I don't even know what that is. Do you like shirts? Uh, but keep spilling grease all over your shirts. <laughs> Hanes Beefy. It has the, the grease stains already in it. <laughs> and that's, once again, Bane's Heefy. And yeah, yeah. Second time's around, Grain's Heeky. So anyways, my, like parents, my, oh, my parents gave a fuck about parental advisory CDs. Yes. And then we would just like watch Die Hard 2, where literally it was like, fuck, 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 and they didn't, made no difference. Wait, so what was the parental advisory about, though? Just specifically music? Just yeah, 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 yeah. Because rated R has existed since 
very early. Mm-hmm. Oh, so I guess there wasn't a rating system on music then? Well, no, the par- the parental advisory was, was the rating. That was like yeah. 90, oh. 93, I couldn't, I couldn't have the Marshall Mathers CD. I, I, all my friends had Marshall? it. I wanted it. The, the Marshall Majors Mar- CD. Marshall Major. Hello, I would like a win a Marshall Majors CD, please. Um, yeah, uh, I, I was never allowed to have it. All my friends had it. That and Word of Mouth by Ludacris. Mm. I was always like so fucking jealous of my friends. It's such a, it, like, it obviously, it backfired a bit because then everyone my age wanted those CDs. Yeah, of course. Mm-hmm. And you they tell made a kid it, they can't have it because it's bad? It was bad. so funny. It started off like with a little thing. Like back in the day, they it wasn't the three bars. It just they had like some little warnings sometimes. Yeah. Like, a, like. Depends, like, I think in England and shit like that. Like, I have an old Clash vinyl that has little ones, like, subject matters, like, iffy, whatever. But matters. once that shit started becoming major news, like, Onyx and, like, Rapper, like, House of Pain, like, they would put them bigger on yeah. the fucking artwork because, mm. it, like, they had, like, ones that were so big, you're like, this must have all the swears. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I must yeah, have yeah, this yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. Like, you know, but then they got smart, too. You know, it could go either way, but sometimes they put it on the cellophane. Yeah. So you can mm-hmm. buy it, take, take it, it off, off, go home. Uh, and then your parents don't have a fucking yo, that's clue. Sneaky. It's sick, dude. Yeah, it was yeah. sick. I got away with a lot of parental advisory albums by just taking it off. Oh, yeah. Well, that's because like, you're, I mean, you would think your parents might at one point listen to them with you, but if. Exactly. No, not mine. So, <laughs> so, the so, so they, they, care, I, they I, care enough for you to not have it, but they won't listen to it with you to see why. Fuck no. No, so, I think you're alone in that one. Whose fault really is it then? Did you sit around listening to uh, CDs with your parents? I did. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> you are such a loser, dude. Oh, yeah. I'd, I'd be like, I want to fuck you <laughs> like an animal. Like, I always yeah. listen to Ace of Base and Aqua. And- yeah. <laughs> hey, mom, listen to this uh, ludicrous. Diana Ross. <laughs> the royal penis is clean, your highness. Oh, yeah. Thank you, king <laughs> shit. Hit all the fall. Oh, yeah. No, I was a good kid. Mm-hmm. I just got bad later. <laughs> yeah, right on. Fair enough. That's the way it goes, right? No, I don't know. Yeah. You guys were born bad. Are we still bad? Yeah. Um, I don't know. I have, we have good hearts. We have good hearts. I think so. I think we're at the we're at the thirty minute mark. Uh, I actually, Are we? Yeah, I brought a little uh, script. If you guys, uh, you what do you mean? A- a I, he, I, I yeah, saw I you have something in front of you, but I don't I just, know. I, wrote, I saw those stained papers, but I didn't know what the fuck that was. Why are there stains <laughs> I, all over them? You know, an artist's work is never done. Oh, and, uh, I don't want to touch so, those. Uh, I mean, we could, we could Jeff, save them. Jeff, you hold them. it for me? No, I'm just kidding. We could, you know. <laughs> no, I'll, uh, you know what? No, let's go. No, no let's, let's go. No, no, let's not. No, I want the stain. No, well, give want, me the fucking script. I want to do it. I want to do it. <clears throat> all right. What is this? A table read? Ew, ew, ew. Just a little bit of a table read. They're all stained. Ignore the stains, please. Oh jeez! Um, Damn! It's just a quick that's a, little. That's a new stain. I oh, they are—they all are stained. Okay, I feel a little bit better. Maybe right. it could be a little uh, like a cannon. I'll—I'll I'll, I'll come up with a like a two. Oh, it's beacon. whiskey. Oh, actually, no. So I'll tell you what it is after we read it because you're not going to oh, touch it. Really? <laughs> it's whiskey. <laughs> it's, yeah, sure. It's coffee. All right, say. James. Let's get right. fucking through let's this. Go. What is it? All right, so it's Who called Win- Winfield High. So you're gonna be uh, you're gonna be Chip, right? <laughs> Okay. And uh, Eric, you're going to be Derek. Okay. Brilliant. Right. Awesome. Yeah, Are you going to read the uh, intro or what, do you, what is yeah, that? Interior? So, yep. Interior? I read uh, everything else. And this uh, is so, a pitch a pitch for Netflix. Yeah. So okay. we're, we're trying to pitch Netflix, uh, get this uh, out on a little more uh, platforms. Winfield High. Uh, so Winfield High. Interior. High school. Day. A high school hallway bustles about between classes. Derek, <laughs> a sensitive introvert, opens his locker. Oh, God. As he does, a book falls to the ground. Aw, oh, man. These damn books. He bends over to pick it up, and as he raises back up, we see Chip Rusty, <laughs> a totally rad skater. Whoa, sup, dude, Reno? Oh, hey, didn't see you there. Sup? Hanging and banging, my little bro boy. <laughs> hey, are you taking Amy Henderson to homecoming or what? I'm still thinking about it. Julie Michaels says that Jess Tromboni is already <laughs> going with Ted Duncan. <laughs> I can't read this anymore. Come on, let's go. Oh, that's the that's line. That's a line. <laughs> I'm just really good at acting. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Sorry, sorry. I mean, Normal you, voice. Well, I can't I, can, I can't read this anymore. I mean, you're not supposed to read parentheticals, but I mean, is everything okay? <laughs> What's going on? Yeah, everything's fine. I was just thinking about that kick, kick flip you did earlier. Oh, I mean, you the one that I did before this? Oh, yeah. Dude, that was sick, right? Over that car. <laughs> right over that car? Right over that yeah, car. I remember oh, that. by the way, here's that $100 I owe you. <laughs> I mean, that's weird. Uh, you don't owe me $100, dude, but. 
No, but I think that you're the coolest, so I want you to have it anyways. I mean... Enjoy. Sh- sure, I guess. Sure, why not? Oh, yeah, that actually reminded me of something. What's that? I actually <laughs> want to give James $100, too. I mean, this is crazy. <laughs> you guys really don't have to do this, uh... <laughs> But, I mean, sure, I guess why not? Well, yeah, I mean, that makes sense. After all, he is the coolest, <laughs> and I think he should be president. Whoa. Three cheers for President James. <laughs> yes, okay. three cheers for President James indeed. I mean, let's not actually do it, but acknowledge the fact that we should be doing it for our best friend more often. Okay. We love you, James. Thank you, guys. Wow. I really appreciate that. <laughs> you know, we need those for yeah. Netflix. Hold on. Well, uh, so yeah. now you, that just made you $200. Where did that hundred dollar bills even come from? Well, I know you guys are big method actors. I yeah. just kind of wanted to test the limits. Okay, cool. You will not be getting the money back. Uh, however, uh, you are considered for the roles. Oh, th- oh my gosh! Cons- thank you, yeah, thank you so much. Uh, don't call me; we'll call you. Okay, okay perfect. thank you. Yeah, perfect. Thanks, President James. Awesome. Man, yeah, great job, dude. Yeah, great that was nice. That was, that's great. That's great job. Ow! Oh, okay. Great right, job, and, when, guys. and now we're done, right? Yeah, that's it. Okay, cool. uh, stay in school. <laughs> school. <laughs> you gotta stay in school. You gotta stay in school. Don't do drugs. They ain't cool. You gotta stay in school. You gotta stay in school. Say what? Say what? You gotta stay in school. Say what? Say what? You gotta stay in school. Say what? Say what? Gotta stay in school. <laughs>